for you. No, no, nah, nah, you're no, all right. No, 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 honestly, no, but on me. I don't know if I. Four, two. Pa four pairs, I want to. Two. Yes. One, two, two. There you go. Thank you very much. Well, bless you, mate. I appreciate it. That's really kind of you. You didn't have to do that. Thank you, mate. That's I appreciate it. Right. No worries. Hope you find some good stuff now. Yeah. Take care, my man. I'll see you around, I'm sure. Tristan, don't be like that, mate. <laughs> Shut the f up, you two. Fucking hell. Through it. Needs the content popping out 5,000 videos a day. How are you both, all right? Yeah. Oh, I'm so guessing I'm. I'm how amazing are you pumping out two videos a day? Impressive. I have no life, Jamie. <laughs> that was really kind of that, mate. So, if you watch this back later, thank you. For, really appreciate that, mate. You make me want to touch hey, myself, baby. Ooh, baby. You good? Oh, you mate, you good? Right, Everyone yeah. else good in here? A bit quiet, so, isn't it? Yeah, so what? I got diverted. Did you get diverted? I know, you lived no, sort of I this way, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, fucking diverted. Long divert. 20 minutes? Yeah, disgusting. Do, 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 do. I know the yeah. How's life, Kristen? All right. Let's have a look in there. I think so. You have more life than the charity shop than I do. What do you mean? I'm in there every day, though, yeah, mate. Yeah, I know, that's the problem. Because it's like, I have to... I have to I have get rid of you, then I'll start, I'll start getting some good... I have to pass it. No, nah, because we, we pick up some same stuff, but a lot of stuff you pick up, I won't even look at. Like them shirt, them jackets and stuff. Yeah, like the, yeah, rackets is another good one. And rackets, yeah, the rackets don't bother me. If I see the obvious stuff, I will. But outside of that... Dude, dude, all right, mate. I think everyone's been scared of the rain this morning, didn't you? How much are your cassette tapes? Uh, depends what it is, mate. Some are brand new, some are used. Uh, how, much is, how, how much is a new one, for example? The uh, signed one, the double cassette, two quid. The other ones are a pound. There's nothing more than two quid there. Excuse me, I'll just put that there. No, my apologies, mate. Thank you. How much are DVDs? One, mate. They're not expensive. Oh, they're all different. Okay, fair enough. All, they're, they're that one, for pound. example. Have it for a How much for this bunch here, my man? Hang on, mate. Oh, sorry. I didn't look up. Sorry. Well, sorry. No, sorry. Right. I didn't look. I didn't look up, mate. You're alright. Oh, sorry. Mate. One. Thirteen, Thank you. Are you taking it, are you? Yeah. There you go, thank you. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Oh, some jelly cats in there, boy. <laughs> How much is that one, mate? A uh, couple of quid. Have a bash on that. Two quid. And what about this one? Uh, Ten or on that. Tenner, yeah. Brand new. What's this one? Both sealed. Oh, yeah, I'm good for a fiver pack on them. So, what have we got so far? Two kids. What is this? That was a Japanese, yeah. Um, kind of animation. Could you do six for the pair of them? I think I've got seven of them so far. Um, not this one, sorry. Yeah, seven. yeah, yeah, seven. fine. Six there. Do you want to make it a ten and chuck that in? Yeah, go on, mate. No idea what I'm buying, I might as well. <laughs> There you go. Thank you, mate. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is this? Little Tom. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Cool. You got some cool little bits, man. Yeah. Glad I could spend some of it. Thank you. I appreciate it, mate. No idea what I've just bought, but I brought it. <laughs> all right, you guys, you all right? Yes, right. You right? How are you doing, my day? You all right? Hello. Yeah. I was going to go you. to Thatcham, but. Mm. Mm. I'm going to go Thatcham later. Oh, yeah. I'm going to go here, then Alton, then Thatcham. Yeah, but Ashton, yeah, you yeah, Thatcham, but yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I normally see at Alton, don't I? Yeah, and we're Bracknell, yeah. so we're in between, yeah. sort of. Yeah. I wasn't even sure. I got diverted because obviously I'm yeah. Tadley way. 20 minutes, last 20 minutes this morning. Yeah. So in the car, go up back roads, down back roads. 
fuming. I've started watching <laughs> every one of you now. Oh, I just bless think you. You're <laughs> oh, thank you, man. I appreciate it. I really do. Some chap here, as I walked in today, he said he watches the channel and he insisted he paid for my entrance. But it was really, really kind of him. Oh, well. Oh, I, it, I, didn't, I wasn't here because I would have done the same. Yeah. No, don't be daft, man. <laughs> what, what, what I meant by that was he's, no, he, he did something similar. He said he yeah. really loves the channel. I love it. And now. I just find it weird because this is just my job. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So to me, this is just well, this is my job, though. I like the one last night we watched about the uh, jumpy at oh paying extra God. seven quid. Bless her, right? She was, she was losing her mind. I thought she was having <laughs> seven quid. <laughs> and I love it that you talk about your family as well. Yeah. That's what I do. Because we've got family. And, yeah. and I, when you talk about your family, and I think, The oh, best bit is when she yeah. comes to the garage door. <laughs> bang, bang, yeah, bang. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to make him get me yeah. a candle today. Yeah, 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 yeah. Big Paul Wicker. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. I'll see you soon. Yeah, Johnny, when are you tickling my pickle? Uh, whenever you need it tickled. Thank you. Soon. How much are you plush down here? It's sort of very really. What about the turtle? All right. Uh, yeah, I'll buy that. I think. Wait, you done with the trousers today? Yeah, because I can't be I can't be distracting you today, Johnny. I wanted you to um. <laughs> I wanted you to have some focus today. I'm wearing a thong next time. I'm wearing a, I'm wearing, I'm wearing a g, -g, 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 -g string. Johnny, I know you like them for your. I know you like these. I love the scoot. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Disney hell. <laughs> Scooter. You only like the maxi ones, don't you? Yeah. I saw one yesterday. I've, ne I've never thought of them before. So the, yeah, they're really easy to like hold away. The day that I pick one up yeah. is the day that um, the best I have to mention Jonathan on the channel. The best ones are when you spin the wheels and they light up. That's like shoes, don't it? <laughs> Oh dear. Oh dear. Okie dokie. I'm sure they'll be back at some point. I know them, they're £7 each day. Okay. I should too, though. Yeah. That's okay, I can wait. Oh, right, mate. That's okay. I just want to know how much are your PS2 games? Uh, well, I think they're three quid each or two for five if you want to skew them. Are they? It's out of my budget anyway. Oh, okay. <laughs> what about the what about the VHS? A couple of quid. Get rid of it. I think they've been open. Yeah, I think I'll take those ones. I appreciate it. Uh, would you do six quid with the two games that I had? Uh, which games did you have? These two. Yeah, yeah, go on, it's fine. It's all right. Thank you. I can't play too much. No, no, bless you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Cheers. Oh, you found some of it when you was wandering. <laughs> oh, no, they're all kids. It might be a squeeze. Yeah, well, do you know what? I bet I can find a way to fit in. <laughs> just yeah. just, yeah. just, just going to take a bit of dedication, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm done here in a minute. These are good, these are, but it's in a bit of a state, that one. So. You didn't have a clue, Tristian. You're like, you're like, um, it's like, it's like our stink when we're at car boot sales. I haven't seen you in here in a few weeks. Do you need to reclimatise towards me or something? I've been alive, haven't I? It's nice and warm. Build a bears and stuff in there, shouldn't that? It's mainly just ladies down there, is it? It's okay, no worries, thank you. Glad to see you doing well. Yeah, thank you. How are you doing? I mean, m minor. I've been buying like random bits, you know what I mean? Not too bad, you know. Yeah, home time soon though. I almost picked it up off him, but I just can't be asked to be looking around in it and stuff like and checking all the pieces. If That's you got, the problem, yeah. Otherwise, because yeah. I think I bought, what did I buy? I bought this off him. A La Crusade thing. Oh. And some weird Japanese booster box. And some Buffy thing. But I don't know, what, I've no idea what that is, but it's probably going to be decent. Yeah. Or it's going to be... Good. Well, you just don't know where these things are. Well, how much did he charge you for the Lego? Uh, one quick. Yeah, nothing, is it? Yeah. Well worth it. Oh, I think I'm going to start. Oh, there's another one there. Oh, I was almost, almost finished. You went like an hour or so. Oh, no, I just, I just don't, because I do three in a day, you see. Oh, I see. So yeah. I go back now, I'll do Alton, then I'll do Thatcham. What's the one in Alton, then? Uh, where? 
Uh, what, what's the one, yeah? Uh, it's at the big like uh, hillside, it's called. Hmm. So it's uh, like 20 minutes from here, give or take. It's all right, it's, it's, it can be quite big. Here we meet again. <laughs> How you doing, all right? Somebody told me off for not picking this up last time. <laughs> I said it's got a crack on it. Did you know if it works? Yeah. It does work. How much are you asking for it? What is it? 15 quid I was looking for. 15. And how much is this? Oh, actually no, I can't bother with that. Let's have a look. So I mean, look to the last person who saw it. She's got a bit of damage there. I haven't even touched them yet. <laughs> no, they're still sitting on the side. Like, if you look at the good old Evo these days, they're like in between a gauge wine. How much are your crayons? I'm not looking for that. No, no, no. Hey. Candy? I don't know. Let's have a look. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Sorry, mate, let me move my shit. Let me move my shit. I'm in your way. Tell me. <laughs> uh, right, 90 quid. Right, What's the best on this one here, mate? Told. Uh, it would be a BNC connector onto them. Yep. Straight from whatever you're using. That's not like a new store. Isn't it? Ain't it nice when you buy from somebody who knows what they're talking about? No, right. <laughs> there you go, my man. Thank you so much. I'm going to get out of your way. Oh, shit. If I don't see you around, mate, again, thank you for that. I really appreciate it. No worries. Thank you, no. man. I appreciate it, okay. dude. Cheers, mate. I'm not one to be ungrateful. We do have a few things here, although the car boot itself for me wasn't really that fruitful. But not only have we got some profit, we've got some lessons as well. And sometimes they can be the most valuable. I can't remember your name, but you will be pleased, maybe. Probably don't give that much of a to be honest. But I saw that chap again, this time at a different car boot sale. I told him that you told me off for not picking this up. And this was the reason why I didn't even ask in the first place. I told you it was smashed up. It's broken just there. But he tells me it's working. Now I'm going to Google how to work this. I'm guessing you attach it to batteries and then run this through something else, which probably reads some kind of current or meter. But if so, I've seen these sell from £333, 150 The median price is about 180 With that crack there, as long as it's working, it might affect the price still. Well, it will affect the price still. If it's working and I can get a good chunk out of that from those varied prices, I'll be happy. But I bought this and this and this for £16 for me. You wanted, you wanted 15 for that, so how much for it all? These are just vintage Bic Auto pencils. There's probably 10 in there, different colours. And they sell from £2 to unlimited, depending on who wants to buy what. And then this big bag of various colours, Crayola. And they are various colours. You've got, oh, that one's actually stamped on there. The other ones are normally... There you go, you can, see, you can see the older ones. These are obviously a bit more modern. These ones are older. So we've got loads of these Binney and Smith ones with aquamarine across there. Salmon, sea green. Just a chunk, just a chunk of nice vintage Crayola. Movie sets will be looking out for these and anybody who's propping and doing some kind of set design or anything like that, well, people may just want to use the old Crayola. And those people that used to eat crayons might want a taste of the good days. Prices again are all off the top of my head and memory. Hold on. Yep. Yeah. There you go. I think this was one pound. Hard man. This is Frank the Turtle. I think his name was Frank. 1993, I think. 1993. Should be like 12 to 20 pound on that one. So anywhere in between that, depending on how I feel when I'm listing. Now the rest of this, apart from these, this I bought this and a couple of PlayStation games for six quid destroy all humans should put somebody else's face on there we know whose face we should be putting on there don't we and then second sight i just thought they both looked like cool games plus this pack of tapes paid six pound for it all i'll probably get that back on the tapes the games there's money in them but they're not great five six quid each and the rest of this is basically the lesson you'll see what i mean in a minute so i saw this i think it's vintage la Crusade. i'm pretty sure by the colorway on this it is vintage la Crusade. Any dates on there? No. Like 90s, 2000s, 2005s. Oh, I have a bit of that. You wanted £2 for that and £5 each for these two boxes here that I'm going to show you. 
So we've got Buffy the Vampire Slayer starter deck from 2001. And from 1994, Robot Carnival trading card game. Cornerstone Communications. Masters of Japanese Animation. So obviously I'm thinking anime, which is obviously what it is. Series 1, 1994. I'm thinking, hoo -hoo, could be some bougie bucks there, boy. Yeah. These, all three of these, all three of them, not completely worthless, but practically worthless. I paid £10 for it all. This one, someone's got listed brand new for £9.90 something. And theirs probably doesn't have some of the glue starting to seep through. You know when it gets old and the glue starts to corrode. It's a wine rack, by the way. It folds out into a wine rack. I think somebody's got three different variations of this up for 15 quid. And this one, people are trying to sell off the packs individually for like one or two dollars. Massive, massive lesson there, isn't there? I didn't do my research, went with my gut. I mean, I thought that the Crusoe was going to pay for everything. Just got a three pound sticker on there. But these are cool anyway. So I think I'm probably just going to put these in the loft because, you know, I've got no desire to sell them off like really cheap. Unless anybody wants someone to offer me a decent price. 10 cards per pack, 36 packs in a box. I'll put some screenshots of what they look like up here. I'm happy just to hold on to them. You never know. You never know with stuff. I'm not saying it's ever going to pay for any big bills, but it, it, could, it could increase. The amount of money it owes me, no issue sitting around. And then these, I was going through the box. So how much for these, mate? It was getting a bit like, I'm showing up the stall, like being one of them. I was, I was polite with them. I said, yeah, no worries, mate. But in my head, I'm thinking, all right, whatever. Anyway, I looked up and I realised, f***ing trader. By this point, I'd already invested two or three minutes looking and then another two or three minutes waiting for him to actually serve me. So I'm five, six minutes in at this point. And I, would, I don't normally buy from these kind of people because they know their prices, they know what things are worth, they're not going to do themselves out. I don't normally bother, I normally skip their stalls. There's a few that I'll look at. But yeah, this guy, you know, classic boxes of sorted Lego, key rings, and I was just, oh, fuck's sake. So we've got, they are from the signed edition, they're signed and sealed, Blossoms, cassette tapes, signed, signed, and signed. Two pound each on them. I think that was a pound three pounds so seven pound i think these are i don't know a pound each eight nine ten there's some bad boy chiller crew sealed one signed by clive one by kane and then paul heat and the king of pop i don't actually know how much i paid if you wanted so two four six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen maybe it was thirteen pound i'm not sure but they're all pretty much just four or five quid a pop and that's free postage and all that kind of thing. Complete waste of my time and effort. But I've had a learning curve, haven't I? Slow down. Look at who you're trading with. Realise who you're trading with. Realise what you're buying. And then step back. Forget about those five or six minutes you've already invested. Chalk it down to a loss and move on. Then you don't have to lose with time and financially. You can just lose with time. Because that's the way I see it. If I've invested time into something... I want to get something back out of it because time you'll never get back money comes and goes you'll make money one day lose money and next save what do you know what i mean it comes and goes there's always an opportunity to make money there's never an opportunity to make back time some of you will be saying six minutes and what when you're on your deathbed and you're down to your last six minutes comment on my youtube i'm down to my last six minutes and i'll tell you and what so there we go. Not all car boots can be fantastic, but it was still decent. What have I spent? 13, 23, 33, 34, 40, 41 pound? 41 pound. I'll get that back plus profit, even if it's broken on the snap-on. He told me it was working and I trust him. He's a man of the forces. All those crayons will do well as well. I'm sure some of this Blossom stuff will tick out nicely on Vinted, but you know, I don't want to be spending two pound to make three pound or one pound. Do you know what I mean? I don't want to be doing that, ideally, but it is what it is. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Oh well. Oh well.